Hey, Thomas here from MGM Classic Cars. And I'm here to show you this California title 1970 Chevrolet Nova Yenko theme car. It's not a real Yenko. We'll get that out of the way right away. If it was, it'd be in the six figures. This one's not. It's priced, priced very aggressively to sell. Gorgeous red lipstick, cherry bomb, red paint on the car. Really, really straight body on the car. It's not perfect, okay, hence the price, but it's really nice, very respectful. You can take it to a car show. It's a very affordable classic muscle vintage car. So again, the chrome bumpers in the back, the emblems, as you can see the California plate. Beautiful, beautiful setup and stance on this car. Look at the stance. Hot rod, vintage muscle car look. This Yenko decal comes off if you wanted to. If you wanted to peel that off and just have a red straight up Nova, you can. But look at the reflection in this paint. Wet sand buffed out to a mere finish. And again, that decal on the hood does come off if you guys um, wanted to remove it. Nice front grill, nice bezels, excellent chrome bumper, rally wheels, got some big 275s in the back, cow induction hood, as you can see, vent windows, dual sport mirrors, nice door handles, trim was painted, I think they did a really nice job on it, roof looks great, so does the deck lid, and all the trim around the windows. Okay, move in a little bit closer to the paint so you guys can see it. See the reflection? Yup, that's me. This rear quarter looks great. The rockers look good. The only blemish is right here on the bottom. Okay, there's a little tiny scratch. Now we can touch that up, but I just wanted to show you. Everything else looks great on the car. All around the edges. There's a little blemish right there in that sticker, okay? Or decal. This side looks great. No blemishes whatsoever. Look at that reflection. Come on guys, for the price of this car, it's not going to last. And again, it's not perfect, but it's nice. It ain't gonna last at my price. Let's check out the interior. Doors open and close great, as you can hear and see. Door lips are great as well. That's why I like, I like getting these things out of California. Newer door panel. Nice door sill plates, inner jam, outer jams look great. As you can see, pro car bucket seats, they do recline, okay? And also we got the seat belts all intact here. Rear seat belts, seat, rear, rear seat belts are intact. Nice package tray. The headliner is a little loose, but the dome light does work. Nice sun visors, excellent dash pad, nice steering wheel. Clean cluster showing 97,200 miles. There's your controls and your triple gauge package. So there's the interior. Let's check out the motor. Here is where you open it, right underneath this Chevy emblem. You just pull it up, one hand. Nice little Chevy 350 chrome alternator, valve covers, air filter, upgraded with headers. You've got power steering, front power disc brakes, a four barrel Holley carburetor. There's your battery. And this thing looks pretty good. Okay, A-arms. The bushings, eh, I would replace them in the future, but um, you know, it is an older car. So nice radiator, no overheating problems. Great gas mileage, to be honest with you. So let's check out the trunk really quick. All right. 
one set of keys. The round one's for the trunk, but the square one is for the ignition. Trunk is very solid everywhere throughout. No patches, nice and clean. Nice and solid. Okay, there you have it. So we'll fire it up, you can hear it. Nice clean carpet. Cluster is very clear and very crisp. One pump. I gotta charge the battery. Fuel gauge works. There's your left turn signal. Your right turn signal. Here's your wiper switch. When you turn it in the on position, it does not work. So that does not function. Here's your horn. When you press it, it does not work. Keep that in mind. No radio. You put your own radio in. Your, all your triple gauges do function. Okay. Listen to the listen to it. Engine sounds great. Let's see. Factory color code 5510. 10 would be the color code. You guys can do a little research online. Now, it's cherry red. It's in your face red. Resale red. Whatever red you want to call it, it's red. Car being from California, no heat. I'm gonna mount the camera, I'm gonna go for a ride. All right. Speedo does work. I didn't mention that, I'm mentioning it now. So yeah, there are a few items that the car would maybe need if you wanted to fix it up, but again, it's not priced, you know, at 30 plus grand either. It's priced to sell. You can tinker with it, have a little fun, but yet at the same time, you can take it to a car show and really enjoy yourself. So, I'm gonna take a ride here. I'm gonna go on the main road and then I'm gonna hit the freeway. seats. They fit really nice in the snow though. And the cow induction hood looks really mean on this car. Text me, email me your zip code, 
and I'll get you a quote. We have enclosed trailers, open carriers, either way. Um, obviously, one's more than the other. But if you're looking for a great spring, summer, fall cruiser, guys, this is it for a great price. Very affordable muscle car. Thank you for watching.